Yup, that's me. And now I am getting ready to make an art piece. Here is my reference photo. It was taken by a friend. And I have here a brown pastel chalk that was gifted to me by a friend too. Here is the methylated spirits. I know you're probably thinking what I'm gonna use spirits for. Don't worry, you will soon know. Here is me making a sketch of the artwork. The sketch is done. Now I shove my pastel chalk to a powder form. And this is done on top of my sketch. I pour the spirit into a container and with the help of a brush dipped into the spirit, I tried achieving brush strokes. Ah. This has got to be the worst thing I've done so far since I started drawing. I am not seeing brush strokes. I am seeing a mess, a big mess. After making that horrible mess, I thought of a better way to get the strokes. So I used the tissue paper and it gave me the result I wanted. It is not really the texture I wanted, but it is better than that mess. Okay, that's done so let's start drawing now let me tell us the reason why i use the methylated spirit i have always admired artworks with brush strokes on them but the ones i really do admire is the ones that look like it was achieved with a liquid medium so at first i thought of water but it was a no for me because i didn't want it damaging my paper how about petrol voice said to me i said to that voice do you wish me well at all come on because if you did wish me well you wouldn't have asked me to use petrol for an artwork why are you suggesting petrol for me come on man leave my head and when i said to that voice to leave my head another voice came he said to me bro how about you use a metalite spirit and i said to that voice thank you you do wish me well. So because I listened to the voice that said I should use the methylated spirit, that's why you saw me use the methylated spirit in this video. But I was thinking to myself after I was done with the work, I was like, I think the best way I would have achieved this brush stroke was if I made the brush slightly wet or if I added small of it into a container and poured the pastel dust into it, thereby forming a paste. With the paste, I would have had a very nice texture. In subsequent artworks, I will definitely give it a try and of course, I will share with you. You are my people. This piece will be available for purchase. Check the link in the description to make a purchase. I hope you enjoyed this video and if you did please don't forget to like this video subscribe to this channel and also turn on post notification to be notified when i post new content now the piece is done i hope you like it ladies and gentlemen i present to you escape from loom